nobody out. The pitch. Stewart gives that one a drive. That one's high in left field. There is no doubt about it. In the Nordson lawn, DJ Stewart will touch them all. Lake Erie takes the lead. It is six to five. Oh, the big shot by the big man, number seven. The 1 0. Here is Arden, that one smacks it in the right center. That's going to drop for a base hit. And it's out. Ken Arizari takes one out of here, gives Lake Erie the lead. He will touch them all in a big way. Just scrapes that outfield wall. And Captain Clutch, once more he is. Lake Erie, they lead. In this homestand. 0-1. And Arizari under that one drives it deep right field. It is up. It is gone! Kenny Rosari said, one's not good enough. Give me two of those bad boys. He will touch them all for the second time tonight. And for the second time today, he gives Lake Erie the lead. Oh, Captain Clutch right on cue. It's four to three. Crow. Daniel Kite on the mound. Connor Owings the batter. And Owings, that one driven deep in center field. That one's up. That one is gone. Connor Owings off the batter. Uh, he will touch them all. And Lake Erie will extend their lead to two. It's nine to seven, Crushers. Here comes the one two from Ketchy. Stort lines that down left field line. It's high, it's deep. It is gone. DJ Stort will touch them all. A solo shot for the DH. It's his second home run of the season, and that cuts into the deficit. It's 6-3, Windy City. Here's the 3-1, and Chile will line that one deep center field. Robertson on the move. That one is off the wall. Casey Combs will round third. He's charging in at home, and he is safe. It is an RBI double by Sean Chile, and Lake Erie, they take the lead. It's 2-1. 2-2. Two Figueredo lines that up the middle. That's for a base hit. Austin White's going to be sent home. There's a throw at the plate from Mang. White slides in. Lake Erie leads. It's 2-1. to one. A clutch two RBI single by Coco Figueredo. 1-2. Gaskins under that one. He drills at the left center. It's down in the gap for a base hit. Coco Figueredo will score. Brian De Alosa is going to be held up at third. Nevertheless, it's an RBI double for Najee Gaskins, and Lake Erie extends their 2-1 pitch. Spillane gets that one deep left field on the move as Owings, and he can't grab that one because it is out of here. Spillane will touch them all. It's a three-run shot in the Nordson lawn, and just like that, Windy City leads 3-0, and Klein will take a drive on that one. That one's deep right field. That one's up. That one is gone. Back-to-back -back home runs for Windy City. Brian Klein will touch them all. And now it is four to zero. Two teams. The two-strike pitch. Charlie, all oh, right to the glove of Elliot Carney. Are you kidding me? Right place, right time for Elliot Carney. And that's a way to throw a scoreless inning. <laughs> Well, it's stretch time here at Mercy Health Stadium. I think Elliot Carney might need to take a little breather after the foul. The 0-2. De La Rosa gets this one. That one's high. That one is deep. That one is way out of here. Brian De La Rosa will touch them all. And it's all gas, no breaks for the Lake Erie Crushers. They now lead by three double-digit runs for the Mena Crush 10 now.